Hi, fourth grade. Welcome to week two of reading fiction. And today we will be focusing on theme. Turn and talk to a stuffed animal, to a wall, to a sibling, to your new invisible friend. What is the difference between a topic and a theme in a fiction story? Hopefully you noted that a topic is only one word, issue, idea, or concept to describe a story. While a theme is the message or lesson you can learn from a story, and that is a whole phrase or sentence. This is review back from Unit 1 when we read The Tiger Rising, and we talked about finding a one-word topic that we could grow into a theme phrase and then use evidence from the text to support our answer. Take a moment and freeze the screen and review how we talked about topics, themes, and evidence during our first unit on The Tiger Rising. Learning target. I can use the text evidence. I can use text evidence to identify the theme of a fiction story. To be successful, students will read a short fiction passage and identify the theme and support their answer with at least two pieces of text evidence. Remember, the theme is the message that the author wants to tell readers. Every story that you read has a theme. It may be stated or unstated. And details within the story will provide us with clues to the theme. Pause this video and reread the story, Rock Climbing. We talked about it earlier um, in this unit, and hopefully it should be familiar. When we're trying to determine theme, you need to search for important details that have a similar message. These related details will give us clues to the theme. So I'm noticing that there are several details connecting to this idea of being afraid. The author wrote, I was a little afraid of heights, they wrote, I was really afraid of looking foolish in front of the other kids. I told my fears to my uncle. He told me that he understood my fears. And then at the end, the author says, I shouldn't be worried about looking foolish. All of these details put together helps me come up with the theme. Do not let your fears prevent you from trying something you've never done before. Now it's your turn. You're going to read this short story, A New School, and answer two questions, thinking what are at least two details that can help you determine the theme of this story, and what is the theme of this story? So essentially, you're doing the exact same thing I just did with rock climbing, but you are doing it for a new school. Find those supporting details and think about what the theme is. Remembering a theme is a phrase or a sentence that is the message the author is trying to teach you with their story. If you'd like to expand your knowledge, you can try identifying supporting details and a theme in this poem called After Wind and Rain. This is the optional extension for the day. Good luck, fourth grade. You've got this.